But I also think that negotiation strategy is something that should be discussed before offers are made, which is something that I think a lot of folks miss, especially in this business. They want to negotiate at the point in time that you're ready to make an offer or when you receive an offer if you're selling your house. That, I think, is... Welcome back, folks, to the last few minutes of the Brian Beatty Real Estate Show here on The Big Talker, 1250 WTMA and WTMA.com. Thank you so much again for listening to this program. Gosh, 10 years have been on here helping you guys better understand the real estate market, the trends within it, and the process so that you're an informed consumer. So again, if you'd like to reach out to me, you're thinking of buying or selling or investing in real estate, maybe you have a property you'd like for us to manage, maybe you're thinking about selling real estate or you're just not happy where you are, give me a call. We'd love to have a chat. 843-800-0065. That's 843-800-0065 which comes to me personally, by the way, or listingsincharleston.com is our website. BrianBeattyTeam.com is another one if you want to check that out. Or you can send me an email, brian at BrianBeattyTeam.com. That's Brian with an I and Beatty is spelled B-E-A-T-T-Y. Brian at BrianBeattyTeam.com. All right, so with the limited time I have left, and I'm going to have to spill this over into next show. It's just the content here is too good to just give it a few minutes here. But I want to talk about negotiating. There are some fantastic books out there on negotiating. But as somebody that has negotiated back and forth with folks, we've done about 1,500 transactions, but obviously there are some deals that don't work out. So we're probably looking at 2,000-ish or more transactions in which we've negotiated something somewhere along the line between buyers and sellers. So first thing that I'd like to say is that, you know, look, every deal is different. You've got personalities that are involved. Sometimes it's very simple. Sometimes you've got family members that are influencing people. And so you have to take all of that into account. But I also think that negotiation strategy is something that should be discussed before offers are made, which is something that I think a lot of folks miss, especially in this business. They want to negotiate at the point in time that you're ready to make an offer or when you receive an offer, if you're selling your house. That I think it's a stressful time. You need to have a game plan on how you're going to address certain things. And the first thing is information is power, not just between you and your agent in terms of how these things are going to be addressed, but you know what is it that either party really wants? Not every seller out there is willing to basically kill a deal because they want the absolute top dollar possible. Some people are very motivated to move, but it's not the listing agent's responsibility necessarily to broadcast that to the world because then it's going to look like a fire sale. Information is power. We have to ask questions and we have to get those questions answered so we can leverage that information to create a better position for ourselves. We have to understand what both parties want. I think another thing that's really important, especially when it comes to real estate, is how knowledgeable is that other agent? Just because I list a two and a half million dollar house doesn't mean that the agent showing it has ever sold anything or even looked at anything even close to that expensive. So there's some opportunity there to educate and inform those agents as to why we're priced the way we're priced, things that happen in that community that might elevate the value of that property unique features, so on and so forth. There's some real opportunity there. But what we're really looking for is where can we leverage the information that we've obtained to improve our position? What are the points of contention in the deal? Agree on the easy stuff and get that stuff out of the way and then focus on those points of contention in the negotiation, which is usually price or negotiating repairs or closing date or closing costs. Really, it has to do with the money, not so much the terms, but terms are really important. So that's something that we have to focus on. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to turn this into a full series and I'm going to put this on YouTube. Of course, we'll talk about it here on this show, but I really, I invite you to check us out on YouTube. Just search for the Brian Beatty team. We've got over 800 videos on there. We're redoing our website right now. So brianbeattyteam.com is probably the better one to use, but listings in Charleston is getting a nice facelift and we're going to have our YouTube feed right on there. But if you want to reach out to me, you want to talk real estate, I invite the call 843-800-0065 or listingsincharleston.com or brianbeattyteam.com. Thank you so much and we'll catch you next time on the Brian Beatty Real Estate Show. Visit Brian Beatty's website at listingsincharleston.com.